Hello everybody, this is Theron. Uh, welcome to Minecraft Maker. Uh, I am here, this is not the Minecraft Land Party server, I am in 1.12 snapshot. And we got parrots. Look at these guys. Oh, and this is the new little white one for the second uh, snapshot that had the parrots in it. It's my dog. Hey buddy. Um, you can still shoot dogs from the boat, which uh, is not great. But that's not what we're here to talk about. We are here. Oh, these guys, um, they make the sounds of mobs around. And when there's a dog around, they bark. And they're a cute little high-pitched bark. And they sound like my dog Bowser, my in real life dog Bowser. It's super cute. So, uh, I just wanted to do a quick little, come here, buddy. Just wanted to do, are you, are you tame? Yeah, you are now. Excellent. Bark, bark. Uh, so, I just wanted to do a quick little video because um, I want to talk to you about uh, something that's going on. Uh, as I've mentioned before, and you probably have heard, maybe, who knows, um, uh, I was diagnosed with multiple sclerosis in 2012. Um, I'm doing really well. I'm sort of best case scenario as far as somebody with MS goes. And, oh, I like how the parrots, they look in the same direction you look. Uh, so I'm doing pretty well. Um, I'm doing well enough that each year... I can march, I can walk, it's not a march, I can walk in the Walk MS event. It's a 5k walk to raise money for the National MS Society. Uh, National MS Society raises money to help fund research and also support for people living with MS. And uh, I'm, I feel fortunate to be able to do this each year. Um, and mostly I started doing it just because I wanted to do something. I just felt like I needed to do something because I felt a little, a little hopeless, a little uh, helpless, not hopeless, helpless. So, so I uh, started doing the walk. Last year, they got their online fundraising tools sorted out pretty well, and uh, inspired by people like uh, Kurt J. Mack and um, uh, you know the 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 hermit craft people and the minecraft people and everyone doing fundraising for for charities online using minecraft i decided oh i should do that um and i've kind of got plans that uh, i'm still trying to pull together for that specifically but the uh the <laughs> little parrot is talking to me on my shoulder yeah that's right um but in the meantime i am doing fundraising through the MS walk and I just wanted to get a video on my channel the walk this year is Sunday I think it's it's April I think it's the 23rd and I will be walking in the Los Angeles event in Pasadena we walk around the Rose Bowl there is a golf course behind the Rose Bowl where did my buddy go you can come to me and we uh, we walk around it so uh, I am raising money to uh, to help with the National MSS. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Come here. I didn't think I would hit you because you were in the tall grass. Why don't you come here? There we go. Tweep. There we go. So, that uh, that is what I'm doing. I'm going to put a link down below. It is a fundraising event. Last year, when I decided to get serious about uh, doing fundraising, I raised over $1,500. Which, in in view of how much money they raised overall and uh and sort of how some other fundraisers online fundraisers have done it doesn't seem like a whole lot but it was a nice start and it was enough to put me in the top 400 fundraisers nationally for the national ms society which is pretty crazy it, i'm actually in the, about the top two and a half percent of fundraisers and this year i would like to raise even more money so um, and I, I was a little reluctant to ask for help because, of course, not everybody can help. And there are lots of charities and lots of organizations that people who do give help, do give money to, are, uh, you know, there's lots of organizations for people to give their money to. And, uh, and that's fine. Um, so I don't, I'm not expecting anybody to actually uh, give me any money. 
or give the National MS Society any money because the money goes directly to them. Uh, but if anybody is interested in helping out and any amount helps, um, even, even a couple bucks, uh, there's a link in the description and I'll put it up on the screen as well. Uh, if I remember to do so while I'm editing, uh, but that is a, a way that you can go and give a it's in in the US it's a it's a nonprofit it's a nationally recognized nonprofit organization so donations are tax deductible in the US um, and I have no idea other countries uh, whether or not um, charitable deduction uh, charitable contributions to charities in other countries I don't know if they count uh, so I'm not going to promise anything there but uh, this is uh, it's a way that you can help out uh, it's a good cause the National MS Society is a good nonprofit in that they over 80% of their uh, income goes to non fundraising operations meaning they, they, they spend their money on helping to fund research and providing support to uh, people who have MS uh, MS multiple sclerosis is an autoimmune disease uh, where the body starts attacking the myelin sheaths that that surround nerves in the brain and in like the nerve uh, and the the spinal column and in some cases other places like the way it was diagnosed with me is I I went blind in my left eye and uh, that was because I had inflammation around the left optic nerve so uh, but the multiple sclerosis uh, causes the body to attack those the nerves the the myelin around the nerves and that interferes with the operation of the nerves so the nerves stop being able to communicate and depending where that happens in the brain or in the spinal column or wherever it happens uh, it it basically uh, causes a wide variety of of symptoms which can range from having difficulty talking uh, to feeling dizzy, lightheaded. Um, it's very common for people with MS to feel high, uh, to feel like the, you know, when the, the room is spinning when they're laying down. That's a, that's a very common one. And in its advanced stages, often people lose the ability to walk and they end up in wheelchairs. Uh, it's a progressive disease. There is no cure at the moment. Most of the treatments uh, are of questionable efficient effectiveness and many of them are uh, essentially injecting drugs that are very similar to drugs used in chemotherapy treatment uh, so they they work by suppressing the immune system to try and prevent the body from attacking the nerves in this way which isn't super great because it, it leads to all sorts of bad side effects so but fortunately there have been some really interesting advances in in uh, research recently and there are there's scientists or researchers coming up with better understandings of how our immune system works and how better to make sure that it, everything stays in balance hey buddy um and so there hopefully hopefully this is something that will not become will not be incurable forever uh, and that there will be an actual cure for, or or at least effective treatment for, sometime in the very near future. And unfortunately, those sorts of that sort of research takes money. So, so anyway, that's my pitch. Yeah, if you if you feel like you would like to help and you are able to, um, you can visit the link in the description, and uh, that will give you. Oh, I'm stuck. Uh, that will give you a, a way of donating directly to the National MS Society uh, on essentially on my behalf um, it is uh, I get credit for everyone who uses that link to donate and uh, and you'll be supporting supporting me and supporting a good cause and hopefully we'll be doing something about this disease so that uh, I'm I remain in good health for much longer than might otherwise happen if the disease begins to progress uh, in a drastic way. So that's it. Um, link is in the description. Thank you for listening. Thank you for watching. And uh, any donations, of course, uh, will be 
greatly appreciated but of course no no obligation no pressure just if there's if you're looking for a, a cause to support that will directly affect people in your life this is one way to do it all right thank you for watching and thank you very much and i will talk to you later bye